hello friends welcome back to the channel so in this video we will go through the basic features that hybris provide so if as you all know in the last video we had set up hybris 6.7 version on our local and we did the setup of b2c accelerator if you want to know how to set up that hybris on your local then there is a link present in the description of this video please go through that also you are seeing in the top right section of your screen that there is a link present you can click either of them please go through that video if you want to know from where you can install the hybrids or you know you need that zip file then please let me know i will provide the hybrid 6.7 version to you so coming back to the topic this is the home page or we can say the landing page of the hybris so once you will start your server and click on this link this page will come so let's see what are present in this page so as you are seeing there is a search text box which is present here then this is the store locator if you click in here then you will be redirected to the store finder page right and then you can find the store which is nearest to you this is the component we can call it the quick order a report safeguard using this functionality you can uh, quickly order your uh, you can quickly place your order or if there is already already a card present and you are logged in then you can import your card this is section we can call it mini card in hybris this basically tells that how many items are currently being added in your cart and as this is site we are opening of uk right so what is the total cost in pound it reflects that this section the above one you are seeing using this you can register on the site or if you are already a registered user then you can sign in now this section you are seeing brand streetwear snow accessories youth and the drop down that is coming this is called the categories so brands streetwear snow accessories youth these are the l0 categories and inside streetwear or brands like you are seeing men women youth these are known as the l1 categories so all this page the home page is basically divided into three sections right first is the header then the body which consists of this banners this best selling products which are called carousels product carousels what's new section is also a product carousels where there are multiple products you can navigate those from here and then it is the footer which consists of the link so let's go through uh, each section one by one now first let me introduce you to the search section so here if you click uh, type anything right so if you type cap then these are the recommendations which we get so these are recommendations we are getting from solar we will talk about the solar in the upcoming videos if the product that you are searching is present in here then you can select that from here or you by clicking on uh, by typing cap you can press enter or click in here then you are redirected to the product search result page right so you are seeing that all the items products that are coming are of cap as you have searched cap so all these products which are present in here are of type cap right also if you are seeing that it is wax so i will i will tell in the upcoming section that when you search cap why it is coming as wax so in the upcoming videos i will walk through you that part as well here you are seeing the sort by option so the products that you are you see you seeing right now is sorted by relevance if there are multiple options using uh, using which you can sort the products so for example if you want to sort by, uh, by using name and name means uh, from ascending order in the name 
means that uh, the products which are starting by letter a should be displayed first and then uh, the the products that are started with the name b that should come later and so on so using these uh, sort by option you can sort the products then the products that are displayed in here the number of products that can also be customized in the left section you are seeing the filter option in hybris we call it facets so like shop by color shop by price these are all facets which we can describe which we can define so if you want to say if you want to see all the products which is of type black the color should be black then just click black here you can see that the applied facet is black now all the products are coming out of are of color black right now this is the search thing that we have seen now coming to the categories so if i am going to the streetwear in the men categories and if i am clicking on t-shirts say then you can see all the t-shirts in the result if you click on any then the page which now opened is the product display page we call it the product display page it basically has all the details of that product right so if you see here here is the product details you can see the specs review right shipping so currently these data are not present in the system in the hybrid system so that is why you are not seeing but generally in e-commerce site uh, in the product display page these all informations are present now here the items that you are seeing we call it a variant so from here you can add this product to the cart you are seeing this add to bag option when you click on that a pop up is a pop up appears which is asking you to either go for checkout or if you want to continue your shopping then just click on continue shopping once you will click on continue shopping you will remain in the same page but as i have told you previously that in the mini cart section you can see like how many items you have added in your cart and what is the price of that item so as you are seeing in here it is of pound 28.31 pound so same price is coming in here now let's get back to the categories section right so let's say if you want to add any other product from here as well so just click on this cart and let's click on checkout now we have reached to the cart page you can see in the link as well that it is the cart page and we have both the items present now let's talk about the cart section here you have you are seeing the items that you have added the order total right if you want to continue further shopping or you are finally ready to for you are finally ready to place order then you can click on checkout the other thing that you are seeing in here related to this coupon section so for instance if you have any coupon using which you can avail the discount so here you have to explicitly enter that coupon and when you will click on apply then this uh, from this order total some amount will get deducted we will talk about this coupons vouchers and promotions in our upcoming videos now let's click on checkout so once you are on the checkout page you have the option to either log in in the system and then go for checkout or if you are new to the, new to this site then you can enter your email address in here so as we are new to this site we will enter the email address let me just put the email address as hybris learning at the rate of mail.com in the confirm email address as well 
I am putting the same email and I will put uh, check out as a guest. I will click check out as a guest. So now we have reached to the delivery address page. Here we have to enter the shipping address detail. So let us select the company uh, country as United Kingdom in the title. We have to put something. Then you have to enter your first name, last name. So let me put the first name as Hybris. Let me put the last name as User in the address line 1 Hybris Delivery in the city we will put London in the postal code some random thing number we will put phone number is optional so we will not fill that we will click on the next now in the shipping method in the shipment method we have two options either go for the standard delivery which is uh, it is saying that it will deliver in three to five business days and for that it will charge you around six pound and for premium delivery it is it will deliver your package within one to two business days and for that it will charge you for around 11 pound so either of them you can select and whatever you will select that will show you in the delivery so let me uh, just go through the standard delivery and i'll click on the next then in the payment and billing address you have to select your card let me select as pizza the name of the card hybris test user the card number so we have to enter a 16 digit uh, card number of v for visa so this is a sample uh, card number for test reference only in the month we have to select any future date and in the card verification number enter any three digits number now for this billing address you want the billing details to be sent to which address should it be the same as for the delivery address if yes then it will automatically pick the address that we have given in this delivery address now just click on the next and then before placing the order just confirm your details and check this box and just click on the place order So order has placed if you want to create an account then you can set your password in here so once you will enter the password and uh, continue you will be redirected back to the storefront and here you are seeing your name in the my account section you can see your order history the emails personal details and other things as well you can even change your password in here right so if you go to the order history then you can see the order that you have just placed so here you can see in the order history page the order that you have placed so friends that is all from the storefront perspective these are the key features which we see in an e-commerce site and these all are all features are provided by hybrids out of the box For closing this I just want to show in the back office that how you can access this order number that will go to the back office I have opened a new tab instead of trending store for it we'll type back office and click on enter so back office has opened the password is admin and nimda all in a small these details were also shared when we had set up the local on our system so once you log in in the back office in the filter tree entries just type order this will come orders will come and here you can see the order that you have placed if you will compare it it is the same 1003 and here is the user details in the position and prices you can see the order entries like the orders that you have placed in the payment and delivery you can check the delivery address and the mode of payment
right like payment invoice visa so all these details you can see in the back office for back office i'll create a separate video where i will show all the details of back office its key features and if you want to customize anything in the back office then how you can do that i'll create a separate video for that and share the details with you so that's it in the current video hope you guys have liked it kindly provide your valuable feedback in the comments also please like subscribe the channel and please share this video with your colleagues as well thanks for watching